let's compare markovnikov graph and anti markovnikov graph addition which are the addition across unsymmetrical double bonds first of all let's talk about markovnikov graph addition according to the modern definition of markovnikov graph rule the markovnikov graph addition is stated as addition of an unsymmetrical or polar reagent across unsymmetrical double bond under polar conditions to yield more stable ion there are certain points in this definition which must be understood like the substrate in markovnikov graph addition must be an unsymmetrical double bond attacking reagent must be polar or unsymmetrical and the reaction conditions must be maintained polar consider this reaction the addition of hbr into an unsymmetrical alkene the reaction proceeds via the stepwise mechanism and whenever a stepwise mechanism proceeds there must be a transition state and in this reaction the transition state is a carbocation when hbr a polar or unsymmetrical reagent adds into an unsymmetrical alkene it can yield secondary carbocation or a primary carbocation and we know that secondary carbocation is more stable than the primary carbocation and according to the definition of markovnikov rule the markovnikov addition prefers more stable ion so far markovnikov addition the secondary carbocation will be favored because it is a more stable let's discuss the mechanism of the reaction first of all the polar conditions ionize the hbr yielding h positive and br negative ions the double bond which is electron enriched attacks on the proton yielding either primary carbocation or secondary carbocation this secondary carbocation or primary carbocation is then attacked by negatively charged species which is br negative in this case as secondary carbocation is more stable so the product formed by secondary carbocation will be formed in markovnikov reaction while there will be no product formed by the primary carbocation in other words we can say that in markovnikov addition the negative part of the attacking reagent goes to that carbon which contains greater number of substitutions as secondary carbocation is further attached with two carbon atoms while primary carbocation is attached with one carbon so secondary carbocation will be favored and it will produce the markovnikov product the other reactions proceeding via markovnikov addition are the addition of water or addition of hx which are the polar reagents and the polar conditions as i have discussed earlier it can be the acid catalyzed addition across olefinic bond now let's talk about the anti markovnikov addition it is the addition across unsymmetrical double bond in the presence of peroxides and non polar conditions the anti markovnikov addition is antagonistic to the markovnikov addition here the attacking reagent should be a peroxide and the reaction condition should be maintained non polar like in the presence of thf the reaction proceeds via free radical mechanism this is the overall reaction the same reaction i have again considered but with non polar conditions and with peroxides when hbr adds into the unsymmetrical alkene the less substituted product forms going to the mechanism as free radical mechanism starts with initiation first of all the peroxides undergo the homolytic cleavage homolytic cleavage means the bond between two atom breaks equally single headed arrow will be written for homolytic cleavage it will generate this species and when this species attacks on hbr it generates an alcohol along with bromine free radicals these bromine free radicals then attack on olefinic bond again causing the homolytic cleavage of the double bond the bromine free radical can add at secondary carbon or primary carbon but in anti markovnikov addition they always add at less stable position or in other words we can say that the negative part of the attacking reagent goes to that carbon with high number of hydrogen or with less substitution this species contains less substitution the carbon is attached to further one carbon and this carbon is attached to further two carbon so the carbon with less substitution will be favored in anti markovnikov addition and this red colored product will not form 
and the free radical goes on to this carbon now this free radical then again attacks on hbr taking the hydrogen from it and again generating br free radical this br free radical again causes the homolytic cleavage of other olefinic bonds and the process goes on these two steps are propagation steps the termination steps we usually do not discuss for this reaction because they usually involve the joining of waste products that like br free radical joins with this br free radical creating br2 the free radical mechanism can also proceed at high temperature or in the presence of light in a nutshell markovnik of addition and anti markovnik of addition differ in their attacking reagents and the reaction conditions under polar conditions and uh, polar reagent the markovnik of addition will proceed while anti markovnik of addition will proceed if the reagent is peroxide and the reaction is maintained at non polar conditions or you are using the thf as a solvent this was all about the difference between markovnik of and anti markovnik of addition like share and subscribe to my youtube channel thanks for watching